Uh, so we'll start from uh, where we left yesterday. Uh, so we did this uh, whole uh, story on starting from co-occurrence matrices. We learned how to uh, get better word representations and the key thing there was we used SVD as a dimensionality comp uh, reduction tool and we came up with this neat uh, result that you could use W word as the representation of the, mat uh, of the words. Uh, it has M rows and K columns where K is very, very less than the size of the vocabulary. So you have achieved a lot of compression and you are still able to learn very meaningful representations which you could use for several uh, downstream tasks. Uh, what to use these for or how to use these for, we will see that later, maybe four lectures from now. Uh, and when I say four lectures, I mean four two hour lectures, right? So it might uh, be more uh, in terms of actual lectures. Uh, so we will get to that, but for now we have a way of learning representations for words, okay. Uh, 